What's up there, ladies and gents? Mike from Dirty Jers. I got uh, Alex here with me today. Um, this is a short little review I got going out, though. But this is with a company I, I showed you guys a couple weeks ago, F5 by Vape9. Um, this is wicking cotton. Okay, guys? Um, I'll just tell you a brief summary about it. I'm not going to get too much into details with it. Uh, I found that line on Flawless Vape Shop. They have it in stock. Actually, they're out of stock of it. Uh, it's unavailable for some reason. It comes in two sizes. It comes in a small, which is uh, $5 for a small. And they have a large, which is $12. Uh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's 12 bucks for a large, but they don't have it in stock, so try somewhere else if you want to see it or do it. It's FlawlessVapeShop.com. F5, premium wicking cotton. Alright, guys. Um, that's what it looks like. I think, what did the guy say? How many feet was it at the vape store? I was it like dude. 10 feet? I think so. It was around like 10 feet. I got it at a brick and mortar shop in town. It's like 10 feet. Um, you know, I mean... Comes in like a strand like that, you know. It's organic. Obviously. The summary is F5 by Vape9 is 100% organic Supima cotton grown in the U.S. No pesticides, no bleach. All plant materials are natural. Oils have been removed by an organic purification process, which leaves with you highly absorbent. High heat resistant, no break in time, natural wicking material that will give you taste buds, an unbelievable vaping experience. Okay, that's what it says is the product description. Now, on this, there's a card that comes with it, okay? On the back of the card, it says, congratulations, you have been upgraded to a category F5. F5 by Vape9 is 100% organic. Uh, it says the same shit that's on there. Yeah, the same exact shit I just fucking read you on the other description is on this description. Same thing. The only other different thing is this. I guarantee amazing flavor, super absorbency, high resistance to heat. Enjoy the change in the weather. Vape 9. Retail wholesale inquiries. F5 by Vape 9 at gmail.com. That's all it is. It's premium wicking cotton. Now, my experience, I vaped on this for a while. I paid, I think, 15 bucks for this. I think I paid around 15 bucks. So it's a little expensive. At the brick and mortar shop I go to, I seem to get ripped off every fucking brick and mortar shop I deal with. Cause I don't, I'm impa I'm impatient. I don't want to wait and order shit online, so I go and get it right away. But anyway, this stuff I'm not a fan of. I'll be honest with you guys. This is not for me. Maybe for you, you might like it. Taste is subjective, but I could vape on it for like an all day experience, and all of a sudden it turns the cotton like fucking brown, dude. No matter what juice. Now, I got like some homemade juice that I make myself. You see how clear that basically is. You know what I mean? No food coloring or nothing added to my shit. Now, look at my cottons there. They're fucking clean. And that was from this morning. You know what I mean? Nothing wrong with them. Okay? If this was from this morning and there was this shit, dude, they would turn them fucking like brownish black. I don't know why. And then like, you know like when you get more like airy vapes? Like from like cotton bacon and all that shit and this stuff... You know, uh, this is organic, just regular organic Japanese cotton that's in here now. But it's like a more of an airy vape, and it lasts all day long. You know, like when it feels like it's clogged, dude? You ever have that? Well, you probably, yeah. you would probably see it on there when it's clogged. Like, it feels like it's like you're not getting that airy vape. This stuff does that. It doesn't, like, you don't get, like, an airy vape after a while. It just seems like it's all soaked in, and it's all, like... And the more you, the more you juice you put in, that side doesn't even fire up. Yeah, yeah it's, it's, yeah, it's fucked up. It's fucked up, dude. So, I mean, like I said, I, that's what I've noticed with this stuff. I'm not a fan of it. I don't like it. That's why, as you can see, I bought it a couple weeks ago. It's still like a brand new fucking thing, you yeah. know. I'll hold it as a reserve yeah. if I need it, you know what I mean? But, I mean, to date, I haven't, uh, to date, I like the uh, Cotton Bacon V2. I'm a fan of. I like that. I like the Japanese organic cotton, which is good also. But there's that Kendo Vape Cotton. Um... I really, really want to get my hands on that, and I can't see it anywhere on any brick and mortar shop around my area, other than ordering it online. But I heard nothing but good reviews on that, so I would definitely like to try that eventually soon. But uh, yeah, I mean that's basically it, guys. I just wanted to give you a little touch base on this F5 by Vape Nine. You know, like I said, would I recommend it? No, I wouldn't recommend it. I've never tried it before, which I'm going to pretty soon, just for the hell of it. But you know, he says not, doesn't recommend it. I say the same thing. Yeah. Yeah. That's pretty much what you're going to hear out of my mouth. 
Yeah, so, but we'll see. Maybe he has a different opinion, you know what I mean? I'll let him try it out. He might like it. I don't know. Nah. But my opinion, I don't. I'm not a fan of it. But that's all I got for you guys, all right? I'll keep it short and sweet. But uh, anything else you want to say? If you're wondering what I'm using, this is a bullet Addy with a iStick 100 watt. Pretty good. That's all I got to say. Not bad, not bad. Not bad. And I just changed the cotton this morning. And look at that. It's brown and disgusting. Look. Yeah, we're going to do a new build on it right now for him. We're going to put Clapton's in there, dual Clapton coils, and then do another juice review on some one of the juices that he's got. Yep. One juice. Soon to come up. Unicorn piss. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we'll do a review next, but uh, we're going to take a short break, and then we'll come back to another review. All right, guys. Till next time, man. Vape on. Take it deep.